Hello, this is Tim Eck from Eck Tech. Making a quick and easy video for you, showing you how easy it is to make Rugal's iodine solution. I have a business where I make plenty of different kind of uh, products that are very helpful for your health. So I want to show you how easy this is to make yourself. Uh, this is a 15% Rugal's iodine solution is what I make. Um, there you also might see available 3%. 5 or 10, but this is obviously going to be the most concentrated. So if you are just now starting out with iodine, you might want to dilute this a little bit more. Uh, I'll show you how easy that is. Uh, just have to add more water, so no problem doing that. But I just want to show you this simple method first. Uh, alrighty. So all you need is you're going to need potassium iodide. And I've got 50 grams here and you also need elemental iodine crystal crystals and uh, I've got 25 grams there it says 50 it was original 50 I made a batch with it so now this is the 25 that's left and this was originally 100 now I've got 50 grams left so I made a batch I can make two batches with this so this is my second batch um, that's why I like using this 15 percent method that I made because it uses even the amount of of iodine and um, your potassium iodide. Some of the other methods call for like 63 grams of this and that, and then you're left with the what leftovers is that you know you gotta somehow figure out to make a, how to make another batch. So this is real quick and easy. You know you can easily buy 100 grams of PI and 50 grams of iodine, and then that will make two two even batches for you. So. Also, I wanted to make note that I have a wooden spoon here. Uh, there's no metal, so this is just glass with distilled water that I poured in here. And I've got right above the 12 ounce mark. That's 13, it's supposed to be 13 and a half ounces. So just a little over half there, right above the 12 ounce mark, is all the water that we'll need. And then you just add the potassium iodide. I died. Did I say that right? I died the water. Make sure we get it all in there so we don't have any left over. And then we'll mix it up with our wooden spoon. If you're wondering what this is sitting on, it's sitting on orgone devices which is made of organic and organic materials that help accumulate the chi energy. So this is actually charging this water up with a good good energy too which I like to do with a lot of my products is treat the water so there we have the uh, PI mixed in there so now we're just going to take the crystals I got 25 grams of crystals pour those in there and we got 50 grams of PI so it's two to one potassium iodine to the crystal elemental iodine and as you can see that's the normal color it's a very yellowish it can stain on everything kind of like turmeric uh, so be careful what you get it on uh, you might want to put down some papers or something if you're making this the first time but you just want to mix it up good just like big kool-aid you know just add the two ingredients this is your 15% right here. Google's iodine solution. As you can see, we have plenty of room in this jar, 32 ounce jar, still to add more water. So, if you did want to dilute it more, you could. So, and then it feels like I got it all, but you also want to let this sit overnight and then uh, mix it up again, and then it'll be ready for storage. You just want to make sure you're getting all those crystals out of there so it's mixed up really well. And then again, like I said, you don't want to put any kind of metal on it because that can tarnish it. So I like using paper towels and just covering it this way so that way it stays enclosed. And there you have it. That's all you need to do. Uh, take a drop or two. You can put it on your skin and they say the longer it takes to evaporate, the, the better uh, supplemented you are with the uh, iodine so you don't have to take as much but if it sticks on there for hours and obviously you're pretty deficient so most of us are I'll put it on there and yeah it'll, it'll stick on for a few hours so even myself so 
that's why I like to make it and have it on hand. It's a really great to have around. So, hope this helps. And if you need any more questions or anything, I should have stuff listed down there below with some more links for you. And uh, also a link above to uh, uh, Dr. Brownstein's uh, Misunderstood Nutrient about Iodine. It's a really great video. You should check it out. Talks about all the great benefits from it. So, thanks, and I'll see you next time.